the OnePlus 8 series is finally here and with the kind of features that it offers with a competitive price tag, both the OnePlus 8 and the 8 Pro are pretty good options. Now if you're eyeing one or if you've already bought one, this video is for you guys. See, a lot of Android experience depends on the kind of apps you install and today I'll be talking about the 7 best free apps that you can install on your OnePlus 8 or the 8 Pro to truly amp up the experience. This is one from Guiding Tech and let's get started. So the first app on this list is something that we've mentioned quite a lot often, but for very good reasons. See, both the OnePlus 8 and the 8 Pro come pre-installed with Gboard, which is a great keyboard. In fact, I love it. But the text correction on that is not that good, which is why I always prefer SwiftKey. But that's not all that this app is good at. It offers some amazing customization options, which include changing the size of the keyboard, adjusting the layout, and using a bunch of different themes. Heck, you can even create some with your own photos in the background. Now, I won't blame you if you like Gboard, but if you want an alternative, SwiftKey is definitely my pick. By the way, we've done great tips and tricks videos for both SwiftKey keyboard as well as Gboard keyboard. So regardless of which keyboard app you prefer, both of those videos should help you out. So make sure to follow that from the link in the description box as well. Next up, we have Notion. Now this new note taking app is known for its great organizational features as well as its basic note taking features. So the app operates on the principles of a block. Now a block can be any item such as a to-do item, an image or a link. The best part is that you can also save links to your favorite article or any interesting article for later references. Whenever you click on the share icon of your web browser, a Notion icon will show up there and you can automatically save a web page as well inside Notion. Apart from that, there is the great note taking features as well. Now we all love to customize our devices and with the Oxygen OS stock launcher, you don't really feel the need of a third party custom launcher. But what you do feel the need for is a good wallpaper app and here we have two. So the first one is Zedge. Zedge has a slew of wallpapers spread across multiple categories, right from AMOLED and neon images to sea beaches and superheroes. The list is pretty endless. Now if you want to take advantage of that camera in the corner, check out Heidi Hole. The app was made for the S10 series but simply flipping an image makes it ready to be applied on the OnePlus 8. Okay, so I've made it no secret that my favorite image editing tool right there is Snapseed. I love it. But the thing is the UI can be a little too complicated and the advanced features may not be everyone's cup of tea. So if you're looking for a more simple and minimalistic image editing software, this picks up. The app is easy and straightforward to use. All the options are neatly laid out in the front and you simply have to pick as per the requirement of the picture. Thanks to its Myrad filters, effects and tools, the app is one heck of a powerhouse and the ability to create stickers and replace backgrounds makes it an easy recommendation. Okay, so this next app should not come as a surprise to you guys. See, OnePlus has always offered great premium devices, but the cameras have always lacked that finesse that separates it from premium devices like Samsung and iPhones. Thankfully, you can always install Gcam for that. Both the OnePlus 8 and the 8 Pro have some pretty stable Gcam ports on offer. Add to that the fact that they support multiple lenses without having to root your device. The installation is simple, just download and install the APK and you're done. The image quality is a massive improvement and it's something you will absolutely love. So you've clicked all the pictures that you want, recorded all the videos you want to record, but how do you actually browse them? Well, OnePlus has a pretty good gallery app, but my personal favorite gallery app has to be pictures. It offers a clean material UI to browse through albums while also offering some pretty interesting features. The photo editor works great and it even allows you to change the image size and remove the location of it while sharing. Honestly, it's one of the most power-packed gallery apps out there. That's it, if you want something a little more different and coupled with various different sets of features, we also have another video talking about the 7 best gallery apps that you can download on your Android device. So make sure to check that out as well. Now we all need a good office app on our devices, be it reading the occasional document, browsing through the random PDFs or actually doing some productive work. Well, for whatever your use case be, we have Microsoft Office. After being in the beta for a while, the company finally launched the full-fledged single version combining all of its Office apps. You get Word, PowerPoint and Excel along with the ability to open PDF files as well. The app even allows you to save them easily to your cloud storage or share them with other users. 
It's literally the best office app out there and you should definitely check it out. And with that, we come to the end of this video. As always, you can find the download link to all of these apps in the description box below. Also, if there's any other app that you feel should have made this list, make sure to comment below and let us know. Till then, this is Varun from Guiding Tech and I'll see you in the next one.